Welcome to Seven Trumpets Prepper. And in this video today, I'm beginning a new project of videos that's going to be shown to you on drones. Uh, I've got quite a few lined up. And this first one, I'm going to show you a Hubson Ready to Fly RC drone. Now, I think this is a prime time to do this in celebration of drones being outlawed in my state. Government officials now are severely restricted of using these devices in the sky. Thankfully, us citizens can put them to full use. But regardless if they were outlawed for citizenry, it doesn't really matter because when hard times come or the end of the world, the laws on the books really aren't going to matter anymore. Now with that said, this drone you can purchase online. It runs about $240, $250. You say, wow, that's a lot of money. Think about this. If this can tell me where the enemy is from a long distance off, like the drones used by the U.S. military can tell troops in the field that enemies are coming, same principle, this is worth every dime paid. Now I'm going to take you in the field in a second and show you the unit. Um, it also has an SD card uh, memory slot built in and you press that button right there once I connect the battery. It'll begin recording so we can get some in-flight footage and I can show you a live feed. Now also, Hubson makes a first-person first uh, view virtual reality goggles that can be plugged into this unit and used in conjunction. Um, I think this would be great for scouting because one person could pilot the vehicle and then the other person could be viewing through the UAV what they see around and wouldn't have to worry about actually trying to fly the vehicle. The other person could actually recon. So I'm going to take this out in the field. Watch me fly it. We can see some in-flight footage, and then we'll do a recap after it's over. Okay, now to begin this process of flying this, we've got our battery mounted into place. Um, the drone, by the way, I didn't mention a minute ago, but it comes white. Of course, I painted Coyote Tan, uh, one of my favorite colors. That and the color blue to remind me of my Creator's commandments. All right, so anyway, I'm going to put the cover back over it seal that down camera modules right there so we've got that turned on now we're going to sync that up with our system make sure to get our antennas properly adjusted give this a minute to sync up all right now we've got them synced As you can see, the drone's not that difficult to fly. Um, give my cows something to look at there. Let's see if I can catch this. Not the best landing for the first try. Now I'm going to actually turn the SD card on, give it a run through, and then we'll get some in-flight footage. Okay, now that I've got the unit up in flight, I'm going to adjust our antennas up so that we have a better feed. And now you can see that the feedback from this is very good. I'm going to go high flight here in a minute. But it's just amazing to me how well the thing transfers back. And you can see even in a high wind day, like the turbine isn't turning right now. If you look right here, you can't see that it uh, really well. But it's still a pretty windy day, but the plane's taking to flight well. Now what I'm going to do at this point, as you can see right here on the screen, is I'm going to press enter. And you can see the recording is starting up. Now what I'm going to do now is I'm going to fly over and give you a high flight overview of everything that I see, you can see as well. And we'll review this uh, on the video here just shortly. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, drones are ruling the skies today.
So I hope you enjoyed the flight time with me today. This drone is an awesome investment, I believe, for those that want to have an extra asset to be able to see as far as security goes. The fact that the unit can take rechargeable batteries and this battery obviously is rechargeable within the drone itself is an added positive measure. Um, not only that, the drone being able to autopilot and correct itself in the air and take a beating on crash landings for pilots like me that obviously still need to work on being able to land it. Um, I think this is a great starter for people that just want to uh, have something RC to fly. I mean, there you go too. But to put back for hard times, give it a thumbs up. Definitely check this out. I'll put the link in the video description below where I got my unit. And until we see you again here at Seven Trumpets Prepper Channel, I hope you have a most blessed day and Yahushua name.